Outcome 11. Take part in a teacher-led, partner-orientated game. There are many games and activities to choose from to achieve this outcome. Here we see the group being stars in the night sky. These children are learning to mirror each other while the teacher guides the group in a variety of tasks in pairs. Whatever game is chosen, the pupils must have an opportunity to explore buoyancy and balance. Clock faces, especially if you have 12 pupils, can reinforce other areas of education simply by arranging the pupils in a circle and giving each a number. A support teacher can be used where necessary to help pupils achieve this outcome. Working in pairs or small groups doing synchronised movements gives more opportunities for the teacher to introduce new elements to the lessons. To achieve this outcome, the possibilities are endless. The teacher can really let their imagination run wild and create their own games. Here we're looking for sleeping spiders on the ceiling, keeping still and quiet not to waken them. By doing this on the front, face in or close to the water, it becomes the skydiver game. For further examples and ideas, the teacher can refer to other amateur swimming association resources.